Hello everyone and welcome back to Next Space Rebels where I'm going to tackle the orbit contract after I tackle the rocket strip tease contract. Uh, anyway, uh, we just need to make a really big rocket with a lot of power. As far as I can tell. In fact, we don't even need to have two different stages, but I'm guessing that it was intended to try to do that. I mean, it should specify that we need to stage, but it doesn't. And we are not going to do with this rocket. This was... I, I have reconsidered this idea. Let's just uh, start from scratch. These parts are not that heavy. Maybe I should use the pallet. Or I don't know if just having a whole lot of fuel will do the trick. Hmm. Let's say we're going to make a two-stage rocket. And the upper stage is going to be this fuel tank. Hot pump for this one and then the industrial pump for the major engine at the bottom. We're going to need a lot of tanks for that, ta uh, that part at the bottom. We don't really need to control it necessarily, but maybe we should build that in just in case we want to use this for the orbit contract later. So... Yeah, we'll have the gimbal on both stages. But I'm thinking that maybe we can use a series of little SRBs as our as our final stages on the orbit contract, similar to how Explorer 1 was launched. Basically, there was a sequence of three stages of SRBs. Uh, but probably those aren't very efficient. No, they aren't. And actually, in terms of complexity, they're not that good, so maybe I'll, I won't do that. Because, I mean, this big booster is 41 complexity for a 7.7 .7 kilogram thingamajig. That's not particularly good when compared to any of this stuff, so... Yeah, I don't think the Explorer 1 model is going to work out for us. We discovered last time that lampshades are not good for us. Now, with the wrapped body, it does have less drag. It's just that the wrapped nose doesn't, as far as these wood parts are concerned, or doesn't apparently have. Hmm, but I don't know if I want... Well, again, structural mass in this case, because we want a heavy rocket, is not a big deal. Beer barrel has a lot of structural integrity. Ooh! Okay, so, well, it's heavy, though. <laughs> 17 kilograms, but it's only three complexities, so if we have a complexity problem, it's big and it's strong. Hmm. Shoot. I wanted a beer barrel as a tank in the first place. Okay, and the gate will be controlled by the number two. Somebody asked where we get the decoupler from, and it was just one of the challenges from one of the people we talked to. I forget who, though. Uh, that will also trigger with two. And now we need a whole bunch of side-by-side -side tanks, because otherwise we're not going to have a bulky enough first stage. But our complexity is too much for the engine that we want, so... Maybe we'll just go with this. We're at 986 kilograms. Can we finally get a one-ton rocket? No need for a gate on this one. Okay, but we need structure, and we have seven points left to get it. Well, how big are those fins, the wood fins? Two. No, they're not that big. Shoot. Okay, well... We'll try with just one tank here. That center of lift is still not good enough, though. Well, let's put extra fins. Fins on our fins. Well, now the center of lift has disappeared completely. No, there it is. Well, it's not blinking red. So, okay. Well, I don't know. It's within the limit. That's all... I can say that is not pointing through the center mass though. Okay. Well, it'll be interesting. Not quite a ton though, because we didn't have enough complexity for that. 
Let's see how it goes. Beer barrels. Okay, well, the mass is important to us this time. Okay, launch. Whoa. Okay. 500 kilograms. Oh, we lost things. Oh, gosh. Uh, it's It was too much stress. Weak structure. It's too much. The pump is too strong. We've got too much acceleration. So let's... Let's make the pump a little bit less forceful. Go back down to this pump. Can we just get rid of these bottom fins? No, not as such. Maybe we can lower these a bit. Oh, well, they're covering the engine bits, so... Okay. So it did come up in the comments, I'll remind you guys that I am going to try and reach orbit with a slightly more complicated rocket, but who knows, I might resort to the single stage, but I'm trying to avoid a single stage to orbit system, so that is a rub. Alright, let's try this. Yeah, I'm deliberately trying to make it a little bit more complicated. Okay, well, I don't know if we're going to get to 10 kilometers with 500 kilograms, but let's hope it just doesn't break apart. Okay. One kilometer. Eight, nine, yes, we did. Okay. And staging. Oh, it all broke apart. Oh, no, that's the... Well, it all broke apart and then it switched which thing we were focusing on. Okay, we need a smaller pump on that stage. Leaf blower or small pump? Leaf blower is such a inconvenient sort of thing. Let's have just two small pumps. Okay. The gate is still arranged as it is. That will reduce our fuel flow to... Well, not quite half, because the tank has intrinsic fuel flow. Okay, let's try that. Uh-oh. Um, oh, somehow we lost a connection here. Don't know how, but okay. We can also delay the ignition of the second stage to reduce the stress. It'll decelerate like that. and end up in at higher altitude in thinner air before we ignite the engine so that'll be helpful that's less stressful for it okay but let's try this first really i don't know if we even have to ignite this engine at all to get to 50 kilometers uh, okay, well, that's 50 kilometers. Oh, uh, mass lowered in 50 kilometers. I thought it was higher. Shoot. Gosh, here I thought it was lower. I mean, it was higher and it was lower the whole time. Okay. Let's uh, try and steer. Whoa, that's a lot of steering. Okay. I want to get some horizontal velocity here. Oh, uh, I'm wiggling. Wiggling. I need to tune that down a bit. So, we definitely want to get rid of the beer barrel. Okay, interesting sounds. Yes, I mistook what I was supposed to do. Horizontal speed. 1.59 kilometers per second, though. We can't really get our apoapsis as such. We'll just have to wait for that. So we'll need a lot more horizontal though. But we weren't really trying to go to orbit, otherwise we'll need a gimbal on the first stage as well.
Oh, okay, I'm satisfied. But, I mean, we, we know what we did there. Viral tag, though. Uh, I guess we should upload the video. Harm online again. Hate? Oh, for using both a wood and a scrap part. Thousand new follows. Anyway, but I want to continue editing that. So... We should select the challenge, and yes, this time read it. Less than 50 kilograms, right. So, let's have a smaller upper stage. Oh, it includes the lower stage's mass, though. I can't get the mass of the upper stage alone. We're not going to have uh, full aerodynamic blocking, because we really want it to slow, be a little bit slower. And gonna just use that's 20 kilograms already. That old fuel tank, forget it. Let's just have a little fuel bottle <laughs> and a little scrap engine and call it a day, shall we? But we'll have to time that. And that gate will be on two. Uh, let's make it on three just in case I don't even have to ignite the engine. So we're going to have to overbuild this. We need less efficiency, in a way. Hmm. Oh, well, we can have two decouplings. Okay. This will not be a very useful rocket, but okay. Alright, we're just gonna wantonly dump that. It won't even be used. Alright, let me see if this has the right idea. Oh, uh, let me see. It might be that we want it that way. Uh, yep, we want it that way. Yes. I forget if I did the decouplers right. Let's see. That's still very vigorous. It might be too vigorous. Uh oh. Ooh. Okay, well, we got to 10 kilometers with the 500 kilograms. Okay, staging. Well, we can just... Whatever. It doesn't matter. I think it'll coast up to 50 kilometers just fine. And it is less than 50 kilograms. What? Uh, I guess we got a weird fuel line thing going there. All right, and we did it. Okay, no problems. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna just upload that. Got another viral tag, striptease. Well, at least we're on the the rebel one, where that's not likely to get me into trouble. Hopefully, unless it's too legit now. Hardly more followers than the fake, uh, the failed one. Okay, um, really did it. Well, you gave me a challenge. What has Sama got a problem with? I don't like Sama. She messed me up. Uh, wow, thanks for the vote of confidence. I wanted those complexity points. I mean, 18 of them. Videos? Okay, whatever. They're called staging. It's called staging. That's weird and you're weird. Okay, enough. <laughs> I've got to stop on that one. Serious talk. It's become an addiction. High altitude rockets? What's wrong with high altitude rockets? They're called sounding rockets. Uh, it's not. I like going horizontal too. Too high. Stop. Uh, thanks. I don't have friends. Take the stop sign though. Just gave. Okay, I was worried for a moment. I wasn't really worried. Uh, I'll promise you I'll take care of myself. Really? <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Let's let's go back to going horizontal again. Um. 
Wood, three structural parts, reach 306. Oh, let's just quickly do that. I mean, three extra complexity, why not? Okay, let's let's use the, the good ones. Let's just do that. That's very simple. All right. Let's see what we can fit inside that without any problems. Let's see, that's too big. That's too big. That gas bottle doesn't work very well. I guess it feeds a little bit better. But motorcycle tank's too big. Old fuel tank. Yeah, let's go old fuel tank. Is there a small oxygen just for fun? That that tank is too big. It's not going to work out for us. Let's just go old fuel tank. Let's just go with that. Okay, that should do the trick. Just need to reach that speed. That's not that fast. Okay, build. Looks good. We did it. <laughs> but it's not hard. Okay, didn't get that high though. It's all that structure, really heavy. This wasn't that high, so maybe it'll actually crash into the ground and make a mess or something. Not really. Well, some bits were thrown up there. Okay. All I care about is the complexity points. Hardly anything as far as follows. Okay. Wrap speed. Momentum. I'm just in it for the money. I'm doing it all for the environment. I'll just go with glad to hear it. Really need you to keep delivering now? Okay. Money? <laughs> Woodland. Celebrates ecology? We want to do it in the woodland area? Because that sounds dangerous. Green smoker. Okay. Nice and eco-friendly. <laughs> okay. Uh, you know. Advertisement stunt. One looping. Uh, let's try to go to orbit. We'll save that for some other time. Let's try to do orbit again. So... I, I want that same rocket that we had before. But we'll optimize it a little bit more. Okay, this time we do not want beer barrel. In fact, let's go cheapy nose cones all the way, maybe? I mean... The retro nose cone, well, it's only five complexity. Mm, this one has more drag. This one doesn't have any drag, you see. And it's pretty structurally sound, too. It's heavy, though. So it increases our dry mass. But it's probably simpler this way. But I definitely don't want to carry the beer barrel. Planks are good. Um, 4.5 kilograms though. No, I think the PVC pipes will have to do. We can potentially shorten this business by having this here. And also having the pumps in this structure here. We just need enough space to get the pipe around. You know, the bike wheel was fully structure, right? It's only two complexities. It's fairly light. As long as it's aerodynamically shielded. Yeah. That bike wheel is probably the best thing. I'll even use it here. Well, I don't know. It's, it, I would like it long enough to cover this. I think maybe we can get another tank here if we're careful. I think we'll use the little fin part here. And then more bike wheels. Right. And we need a combiner. That should be enough clearance. Well, now we've got two tanks well under the complexity limit. I would like to shield our aerodynamics a little bit better. We've even got some spare capacity here as far as complexity is concerned. 
Let's see, can we get rid of these fins or not? I always want to get rid of those bottom fins, but... Uh, it looks like we can here. Uh, that's pr uh, actually, that should be aerodynamically shielded there. So we can move them like that. We could potentially have a third tank, I think. 31. Yeah, I mean, if we could fit it right without too much more structure. But the problem, the bike wheel... Well, it's only 27 structural soundness. So, yeah, it might be a problem. I mean, it's not as bad as the lampshade, which is two. But still, this might not be good enough. Anyway, one thing I wanted to do was tune down the swivel. We do need to make sure that the gate is... That's two. All right, that's fine. And this should be on two. Yes. Okay, we'll see what happens. Uh, oh, I should put this on a gimbal as well. And uh, yeah, I'll steer that one up down and we'll also have it at 12. Okay. Well, who knows? That thrust looks fine. Uh, oh, that got disconnected somehow. All right, let's find out. Uh, a little bit wobbly. Horizontal speed. Oh gosh. Well, how am I gonna deal with that? <laughs> um, uh, abort. I should launch it quicker, I guess. Uh, gotta try and tuck the two together a little bit tighter, maybe. Okay, that's one thing. And this fin is a little bit off. Okay. Nearly a ton. Okay, uh, fine. Launch. Let's not wait around here. Okay, um, up. Oh, up, 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 up this way. I don't know why I want to go this way, but... <laughs> okay, how about a follow cam? Oh, this is inconvenient. Alright, um... It's still a little bit touchy. Okay, stage two. Oh, that did not stage right. Oh no. No. No, that didn't stage right. We were going so well. Let's see what the top height is here. Whether that trajectory got us to 1,000, I mean, 160 kilometers. Well, um, we can sort of control it. <laughs> oh, uh, we can actually gain horizontal speed like this. But that's it. Okay, well, potentially 160 kilometers here, but I don't think it was a very good test. Back to design. Uh, what happened? Why did you not decouple? You're triggered with two. Well, we clearly had thrust. I wanted finer gimbling here. Yeah, I don't know why that didn't de decouple with two. Obviously, the engine would not have lit otherwise if I didn't press two. Let's see. Okay, launch. Okay, I'll let go up for a little bit. Oh, it broke up. It broke up. Uh, too much stress. Um, I could upload the video, but... Okay, let's upload the video. You often I like to connect uh, diverse sound barrier broken nose. Okay. Just in case I want the craft file again, I should. Hmm. Yeah, well, it worked. The structural soundness worked out the first time. So I just need to watch out how I'm gimbling this thing. Maybe I'll wait a little bit longer.
Oh, oh. Uh, okay. Might have to use that auto gimbal thing if it works. But then it's only expecting fins though, so that would be a problem. How did, how come we have so much more acceleration and stress like this? When the first flight we didn't. Well, let's see. I won't gim I really won't gimbal much. Let's just wait. Till we get to thinner atmosphere. Okay. Oh no, that was too much. Okay, well, hmm. I need to be able to gimbal somewhat. I guess maybe maybe I'll do it earlier. Let's try that quickly. Okay, I've immediately started a little bit of a pitch program. Don't need a whole lot more than that. That'll be fine, actually. Oh, it broke up again. Okay, maybe our bike wheels are a little bit too optimistic. Gosh, it worked the first time. Maybe I should just have a lighter pump. I mean, it does solve the whole punching through the atmosphere deal, but we don't need to go that fast. Let's just once again have two of these. Yeah, let's hope that limits it a little bit. I like the bike wheels, so we're gonna stick with them, maybe. I'm gonna only have one pump there, because if we only need two of those down there, we might not need that much up here. We launch. Very sedate ascent this time. Well, it's sort of going this way. We'll just go with it. Uh, okay, I said go with it. <laughs> There's much more the ascent rate of a real rocket. Barring the more feisty ones. And the uh, stage length of a real rocket, too. Oh. No, we should be through max Q. Wish I had like apoapsis and periaps. Well, apoapsis data in particular. Well, we'll see how staging goes. Okay, staging. Okay, we have a stage. Oh, but control is not good and we've changed camera for some reason. No, come on. No. Wrong thing. No. What? What about the other thing? I hear the engine. Game. I don't care if it broke bar. I wanted you to follow the other piece. I mean, come on. Ah, <sighs> it's messing with me. Well, let's see how high this went and whether my trajectory was good. If it's good, then we shouldn't go much higher than 160 kilometers. I mean, definitely should not go higher than 160 kilometers. We could go less and it'd still be all right. But. Well, it looks like about 152 kilometers, which is fine. That's an uh, acceptable way to go. Okay. Weak structure. Hmm. Record distance, though. Let's upload it. Let's just not have that pump at all. I think we have enough hang time. 
Maybe this stage needs to be offset a bit too. Okay, I don't know why I didn't follow this part. Let's get the challenge up. We'll see what happens. Okay. I think we'll go shallower this time. Okay, staging. Okay, focus. No, don't go down. Why? Why are you going down? And then it... it okay. Hmm. Maybe, maybe our aerodynamics is bad on that stage. Though, the last time we were in such thin atmosphere, I would be surprised, but... Okay. You know, we've got some spare capacity for finnage. We can do some finnage. These should have already counted as fins, but... Okay, I bite. How about how about we? Maybe we can take those off and put these on and see. That might throw things off for the lower stage, though. No, it still seems fine. So if it is a matter of fin stability stuff, we can do it this way. But okay, let's see if this works out. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense if it's fins, though. Okay, launch. Stop messing with me, game. Oh, that's pretty good. No problem with that, as far as I can tell. Little bit of a correction there. Okay, I have to remember that left and right are the actuators for this engine, so it will be important. I don't can't use the same keys that I did for the first stage. Okay, and go. Okay, well, it looks like we're stable and it was the fins that were the issue. We might want lighter weight fins, though. Okay, we are still going. I guess we can go with the onboard camera now. There we go. And... Well, I don't know which way was which. Nice view. Uh, we really need the hor uh, vertical speed. Okay, I need more. Remember, the last bit of the burn gives you most of the delta V, so... We will see. Okay, we're uh, able to get... ...vertically stable like that. Okay. All right, last little bit. Five point six nine kilometers per second. So we need about two thousand more. We'll see what height we get up to. It doesn't look like we'll get to one sixty either, but we are going to set some records here. We could optimize these two stages a little bit more. Oh, looks like 144 kilometers is where we ended up. Well, let's see at these speeds whether it burns up or not, shall we? Yeah, the fins are definitely not optimal. I mean, those are heavy fins at the bottom there. There might be something large that can take the place of the bike wheel. The nose cone is sort of an issue. But it's sheer nice in terms of not having any drag coefficient, so that might be an overriding plus. It could be that if we can sneak another tank onto the first stage that could do the trick. Might need a bigger turbo pump in that case, because 
we will be heavier, and our thrust weight ratio is already fairly low. Oh, uh, what? Oh, um, on board? Zoom? Oh, I, I think it just eliminated it. Okay. No fireball. Just random elimination. Got a viral tag. Record distance, 1,074 kilometers. Okay, oh, and record loopings. No, no, that's our record. We've only got three loopings. Okay, upload video. Hypersonic roller coaster. A whole lot else is there. Hypersonic is important, though. Okay. Well, I feel like I've accomplished something. We have 50 extra complexity to work with to get that extra 2,000 meters per second, so it's just a question of how we want to do it. Uh, this is definitely a solid rocket. No, no, not a solid rocket. I mean, it is a good rocket. We will see where I can take this in the next episode. So, with that, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do press like. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. And I'll see you next time.